41st uh, Cathedral Park Jazz Festival. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, can you tell me about um, why do you like crows? Your crow? Oh. Give her the mic. Give her the mic. Oh, they're non-binary. They use they them pronouns. Oh, can you give they the, the mic? Them. them. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not first. <laughs> You're good. Welcome to Portland. I know, it's my second time. I got, I got busted the other day, but I was like, I don't know, I don't know how it works. Yeah, well, <laughs> you can teach me. If you want. They use they, them pronouns. It means that we, I mean, we both are non-binary, so we don't either conform to male or female gender. <laughs> okay, okay, so, so I just call her she, and so can you tell Called me them. Like, I know, I know. I'm, I'm, I'm going to educate my viewers, okay? So, um... Why is it not they? Is it them? Is it oh, they? that would just that just be grammatically correct. So like you wouldn't say um, them lot them left their umbrella here. You would say oh they left their umbrella here. But then if it's directly like she did a great job, it'd be them did a great job. Well, you would normally say they did a great job because you wouldn't say like no, it's confusing. It's she's confusing. did a great job. It's confusing because like I was I was trying. Mm -hmm. and I, used, I said she and then they said they, but I thought it was them. But I get confused between they and them. Yeah, honestly, it might just take practice. So sometimes when I learn somebody's pronouns for the first time, I just rehearse it in my head two, two or three times. I just say, um, if I meet somebody new and they use like he, him, I'll say, oh, um, this is this is Andy. Use, he uses he, him pronouns. So he will go get a glass of water. He'll drink that water and he will be my friend. Like, and then uh, just those three three times in my head is normally enough to make it stick. Um, and honestly, it's not that hard once you get the practice. The first few times it takes a little bit, but it's just like how you would say, you know, they left their umbrella here, rest versus like, if they didn't know, if you didn't know who left their umbrella here, you wouldn't say she left her umbrella here. You didn't know who did it. Because for me, it's always, it seems like it's a plural pronoun. That's a common misconception. Yeah, but it's grammatically not a plural pronoun because if you would say they left the festival, you wouldn't be meaning, I mean, if you could be meaning me. You could be meaning like that person right there. You don't know. So they left the festival. Okay. Okay. That makes sense, right? Then, what about them? What do you mean about that, them? We would give them the microphone. <laughs> Just like you would give him the microphone, right? You wouldn't give his the microphone. You would give him the microphone. So grammatically. And is there only those two? No, um, no, actually, dating back, you know, thousands and thousands of years, there's actually a lot of different pronouns. Sure, sure. Yeah. Okay, so thousands of years? Yeah, um, dating back thousands of years, there's actually been a lot more than just he, him, she, her, and they, them pronouns. Um, Native Americans have had two-spirited people. Um, I mean, I don't know enough to, like, want to go into too much depth because I don't want to and talk about too much stuff that I don't know too much factually about, but um, there's a lot more than just just one or two pronouns. Um, I mean, there's the whole new conceptualization that we don't even know what gender is. Do, do okay. you know what your reality is? Okay, so then I just said, incorrectly, I said, is she your sister? They're my sibling. They're my sibling. Okay. Yeah. Siblings. Yeah. Got it. Okay. So that actually threw me. That actually threw me. I was like, uh, is that my cousin? No. Sibling? No. Yep. Sibling. Yeah. Sibling. <laughs> Just like. No, no differentiation. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And do um, you have other siblings? Yep. Yeah, we have a couple. 
Yep, there's a couple more of us that identify as non-binary. And you identify? Yep, I am non-binary. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, I mean, I know, uh, I mean, I'm kind of like dominating this conversation. I don't know if Ren has anything to add. Um, for me personally, um, I didn't get, I wasn't allowed to explore my own gender until I reached adulthood and I came, officially came out um, just about two years ago. Um, but since I was a kid, I knew that I was definitely not what everyone was calling me.